I started here 17 years ago for Bob was just trying to get everything back to original. He was working so much on the art, they didn't have a lot of time to work on the buildings and the, and the property itself, so I kind of took that on. I think this was done in the 70s, and this shows all Bob's property. And the first one, the first parcel we bought was this one over here, was the old beach house, and then this section here was his, his first studio. And then Jungle Road here, he drove a Volkswagen, he had this and that, two Volkswagens, and he drove one through there, and wherever it fit through the trees, they would flag it, and that's what became Jungle Road. Maybell Stamper's old cottage, that was an old Sears cottage that came over on a barge. She used to tell stories about walking down the beach in the 30s and 40s naked with her cats because there was nobody out here. We were at the Ding Darling house, which is on the water. This house was built in 1942. Uh, Ding built it for his wife for their anniversary, I believe. That's the Bay House, and he had this portion here. This five acres was Ding's back in the day. The way he designed it was all the walls were built double thick. So all the walls and all the rooms have storage in them. And this one here is where his, his drawing table, where he'd actually uh, probably did some sketching and writing, but he, you know, just everything was, you know, old cracker, the way, the way it should be. Yeah, the old bathroom in here. The toilet and the sink were from the 1890s. We were able to get that, that old tub uh, reglazed and the sink reglazed. Bob was so concerned about hunger and AIDS and, and all the afflictions that we have here in the world. It's, it's been his life's mission to, to correct all that. He had pass-through doors on, on both sides of this, so you could probably isolate. I don't know if it was for when it was cold or what. Bob was such an animal lover. I think he liked just about everything but politics. Now that's forward thinking. Every single room, you go, well, there's not a lot of space, but when you start looking, I mean, there's just storage. Again, everything was all about airflow. And as you can feel in here right now, it's probably what, 92 out? And even in the heat of the summer, if I open the entire house up, all the doors and everything, it always stays cool. What do you think, Cassie, huh? You got anything to add? You know, just try to keep it just as original as possible. That's how Bob always wanted it.